Welcome to another simple instructional snippet. In this instructional video, we will work a Carnot cycle example. A Carnot cycle operates with water as the working fluid. The thermal efficiency is 0.25. The heat transfer into the cycle takes place at 300 degrees Celsius, which changes the water from a saturated liquid to a saturated vapor. The Carnot cycle is shown on the TS diagram. We will be determining the qualities at point 3 and point 4 and the specific work out of the cycle. We will need to determine the temperature for the isothermal heat transfer out of the cycle. The cycle efficiency is known, which in this case is also the Carnot cycle efficiency. The Carnot cycle efficiency can be calculated using the absolute temperatures for the heat addition and heat rejection as shown. Recall that we need to use absolute temperatures for this equation. The temperature for the isothermal heat rejection is 429.9 Kelvin or 156.7 degrees Celsius. Now we need to look up some saturated properties, in particular specific entropy. Point 1 is the saturated liquid point for the isothermal energy addition. Point 2 is the saturated vapor point for the isothermal energy addition. We can look up the corresponding entropies from the steam tables. We do not know the entropies for points 3 and 4, however, we do know that these are saturated mixtures. Since we know the temperature, we can look up the values for the entropy of saturated liquid, SF, and the difference between saturated vapor and saturated liquid, SFG. It is clear from the TS diagram that the entropy at point 1, which is known, is the same as the entropy at point 4. Using the equation for the entropy of a saturated mixture, we can solve for the quality at point 4. The quality at point 4 is 0 0.2760. The entropy at point 2 is the same as entropy at point 3. Repeating the process, we solve for the quality at point 3. The quality at point 3 is 0 0.7794. Now let's work on finding the specific workout. We were given the cyclothermal efficiency, which is equal to the specific workout divided by the specific heat addition. The specific heat addition is denoted as QH. Let's find QH. QH is equal to the heat of vaporization, HFG, since the heat addition transforms the saturated liquid to a saturated vapor. Please note that this is valid for this particular example and is not true in general. The heat addition is equal to the area under the heat addition process or the line connecting points 1 and 2 on the TS diagram. This is just TH times SFG. We have all this information and we can calculate QH. QH is equal to 1405 kilojoules per kilogram. Now we can return to our cyclothermal efficiency equation and solve for the specific workout. The specific workout is 351.2 kilojoules per kilogram. I hope you found this instructional snippet useful. If so, then please like and subscribe. Thanks and have a great day.